let me transfer you. Switch to Farm Bureau Insurance today and get real service instead of getting really tangled up. For auto, home, life, and health, get the membership advantage. Get Farm Bureau Insurance. Like Coach said, I've, I've you know faced a lot of adversity in the last couple of weeks, um, missing the kick at Villanova, uh, having an unfortunate referee decision at at uh, Georgetown, uh, but you know everyone everyone stayed by me, uh, everyone supported me, uh, and that goes for Coach London as well as the team, as well as my immediate family and and the rest of the Spider Nation, uh, and it means so much to me. Um, that's what got me through. I practiced hard all week and. Uh, Ended up coming out as a plus uh, this this afternoon. You know, got a lot of rest last night. Um, warm up, warmed up for the game this this morning. Um, did everything like I usually do. And the first kick, I hit really well. I was happy with it. The second uh, and third kick, I wasn't happy with. Obviously, um, didn't hit him very well. But the third kick, I was you know, it meant a lot to me that coach put me in the situation. Had faith enough faith into me. To put me in that situation, and uh, I just I just went through my technique and kicked it. And at that point, I was just going through my technique, uh, just going through everything that was um, taught to me and everything that's become a habit for me. And I just had to stay focused. I couldn't get if I went to the sidelines. Um, could have lost focus, something could have happened, uh, but, you know, I had to stay there. How, and, how big was the wind, if at all? Uh, the wind was fine. The wind was, uh, I don't think there was much wind. Uh, with this stadium, I found in the last three years that, uh, or three and a half, you know, the time that I've been here, that um, the wind will be kind of coming in from the uh, opposite of the scoreboard side uh, pretty strong, but today it was not uh, strong at all. Um, and it wasn't it wasn't a problem at all. You know, when you put in a situation like that, you're expected to do your job and and, and be 100%. And when when I missed the kick a couple weeks ago against Villanova, I just you know I felt like I had let down everybody that believed in me, and uh, it really. It really got to me, but as soon as the game ended and we went into the locker room, um, I realized how much support and how much love that the team and coach, coaching staff, Coach London, has for me. And uh, they just told me to keep my head up and keep working. And uh, and then today, you know, getting put in the same situation, uh, a little bit farther of a kick on the opposite hash, and uh, you know, I, I was I was surprised that Coach London put me in. Um, he had he had kind of dabbled around with the with the option of putting Cayman in and uh, and I'd been ready all all half uh, to kick to, if I was put in the situation and when he called my name I ran out there and just knew what I had to do and uh, you know it's it's just this is what I work for this is what I've started kicking for um, is this situation and kicking a game winner like that and, and make my team happy and the the feeling is just indescribable I can't I can't put in words to it you know. I got the easy job. I mean, <laughs> catching the ball and putting it down. Um, I mean, Andrew did a great job. I mean, we got a great snap. And like I said, I mean, that's pretty simple, just catching the ball and putting it down. I mean, I guess you, you become more comfortable with it the more times, the more times you have to go through the drill. And we've we've had to run it a few times over the past two 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 years, and I mean we practice it every week in practice. So I mean it's one of those things where I mean just repetition, um, knowing what knowing what throws to make and what which one, which routes is going to be open, like just knowing the situation, knowing that the defense is trying to try not to give you too much yardage, but they're going to give you short throws, and just taking what they give you. Um, that's pretty much it. I mean that's that that is big. I mean especially especially um, seeing the turnout we had today and 
I mean, all of the support that we've been getting all year. Um, um, we appreciate all the support from the fans. And, I mean, it's a great feeling to know that we, we could be playing the next two games back here back at home. I mean, it's pretty frustrating because, I mean, obviously the game is out of my hands or is out of the offensive hand, offense's hands when um, in a situation like that. But um, I, I put my defense up against any any team in that situation any day. And, I mean, they stepped up big once again, um, got the ball back for us on Justin's pick. And, I mean, at that point, we was like at the 50-yard line and I just – we had time to run about two plays. It was like 14 seconds left. I knew we had about two plays, maybe get a timeout and, and give the kid a shot. And um, I mean, that's all I tried to do, just just try to get a, get take what they gave us. And we got a chunky, good chunk of yards on the first play that, um, with Trey, who had the hot hand all day. And I mean, got a few extra yards on the second play. And I mean, the rest is history. Yeah, uh, actually on that play, I was a flat defender. We were in cover two. You know, we wanted to stop him from dinking and dunking, trying to get a uh, little, you know, small yardage trying to get close on a field goal. And um, actually, you know, the play just happened so fast. I, I was, you know, in a flat defender. It looked like Archer was going to run. And uh, he, he pumped the ball. I guess he expected me to bite on it. But I was just, you know, more concerned about the receiver in front of me. And once I didn't bite, uh, he, he threw it to the receiver. And I think the receiver never even saw the ball coming. And, you know, I just, it's a fortunate situation. I ended up catching the ball. And it was a big play for us.